Ah, uh, I see you have good taste. Dolls? In the underworld?
sucede? Phoebe? Oh, Phoebe, I never thought I'd see you again. Are you a goddess? Phoebe, it's me, Cassandra. It's nice to meet you, Cassandra. Is that your eagle? I wish I had an eagle. I know you do, Phoebe. I know you do. What are you doing here? Playing? How do you know my name? I could never forget your name. There hasn't been a day I don't think about you. I don't remember you. Do you work for the man with one eye? Who's that? He gave me this water when I was thirsty. You drank Lithi's water? Phoebe, this is very important. I need you to remember who gave you that. I... I don't remember his name. Um, he took my toy. You had an eagle, like Icarus. If we get your eagle back, maybe you'll remember. No, I remember everything. I think. Do you remember anything from before drinking that water? No. I, I've always been here. Try to think. Do you know where the man with one eye took your wooden eagle? I think he said something about a pit. The pit of deprivation? That's it. The man with one eye should never have given you this water or taken your toy eagle. We're going to get it back. You mean steal? Stealing is exactly what I mean. Something tells me you are going to be a natural. Want to come with me? You want me to come on an adventure with you? Okay. Then let the adventure begin. You remind me a lot of a girl I knew on Kefalonia. Have you ever been there? I've always been right here. What was the girl like? Oh, she was brave. And smart. She'd say she looked up to me, but I'm the one who looked up to her. You looked up to her? Did you ever tell her? No. I wanted to. But I ran out of time. Don't be sad. I bet she knew. That girl left Kefalonia eventually. Where did she go? Athens. Where she was loved by people like Pericles. Does that name sound familiar to you? <laughs> That's a funny name. It sounds like a sneeze. What about Anthusa? No one who meets her forgets her. No, sorry. Okay, we're here. You better stay put while I go find your toy. This area will be well defended.
This doesn't bring her memory back. We'll make new ones, together. needs a king, Agamemnon. Go to the gates and protect the people the way you do best. My 
eagle! Couldn't have done it without you. Now, hold it. Do you remember anything? Cassandra? Yes. That's my name. Good, Phoebe. Good. wrong with you. Adults are selfish, stupid. They don't realize how incredible a girl like you is until you're gone. What do you mean? You still don't remember. Those men with the knives and masks. Phoebe, you didn't survive that night in Athens. No, that's not possible. I wasn't sick. I was just helping Pericles. Then... Oh... I'm so sorry, Phoebe. I'm... Where are the Golden Fields? You mean Elysium? I was there. It was beautiful. But I came here to find my parents. You traveled to the Underworld to save your family. Very brave. Just like you want to find yours. But mine still need me. I should go to them. Phoebe, you've been through a lot and you've never met your parents. It's okay to be nervous. I was nervous to meet mine. I wouldn't be nervous if you came with me. Before we go anywhere, where are your parents? I was following a clue. It said... Those parted from their beloved are doomed to the Ixion wheel. Maybe I'm their beloved. Are you sure you're okay? No. But Amistios taught me to always be brave. Even when I'm feeling down. So I am being brave. Sailing to Elysium can be a difficult journey. Do you know how long you were there? I woke up on a boat. Everything was cloudy. Then there was light, and golden fields, and waterfalls. Only the bravest warriors are allowed there, you know. Descending to the underworld is proof that you deserve your place among them. Oh, I don't know. It would be an honor to be there for you when you meet your parents. The last I heard about my parents, they were hiding near the Ixion. Hiding? From what? The underworld is scary. Maybe they're not fighters like us. I could teach them what they taught me. I'm sure you could.
Bibi, stay back. the Cyclops, the girl isn't here, and neither is her family. Now get back! Relax. We're not going to hurt you. But we need to know what happened here. Those thugs followed the Cyclops of Kefalonia to their graves. And now they follow him in the underworld. He sent them through here, looking for a girl. The man with one eye. Have you ever met a girl named Phoebe? We don't know of Phoebe. Why were they looking for the girl? I'm not sure. I was a friend to her parents. They used to hide here. They told tales of their daughter, a great warrior who sailed to Elysium. They called her a warrior? When Cerveros died, they snuck off to the Golden Fields to find her. But now, the Cyclops is looking for them all. Excuse us, please. I remember now. The man with the one eye is the Cyclops. He forced me to drink the water. He must know we stole your eagle back and came to retaliate. What do we do? The gates to Elysium are open, but you know the Cyclops. He won't stop until he gets what he wants. We have to deal with him. What about her? She's a friend of my parents. I want to help her. She seems like she can fend for herself. The Kiris are magic. They heal people who get hurt in battle. They live close by. I could... Phoebe... I can do this! I'll be quick, then we can fight the Cyclops. <sighs> All right. But don't take too long, or I'm coming after you.
TB's eagle. But where is she? Eagle bear. Said. Tell me what you did to Phoebe. Bearer. I overheard the Cyclops saying you were in the Underworld, but I didn't believe it. I'm looking for a girl. Her name was Phoebe. It is. Her name is Phoebe. They took a girl onto one of their boats, but... But what? She wasn't moving. Tell me where they were sailing. I couldn't see. The Charon's at the dock on the riverbank. No one sails without him knowing. How long ago did they leave? If you set sail now, you could probably catch up to them. But be quick. 
Get out of here while you can. I'm going to find the Cyclops and stop him once and for all. Take this as thanks. You can pay Haron to send you down the sticks after them. One of the prisoners said the Cyclops took a friend of mine down the sticks. Oh, the young girl from Elysium. They dumped her lifeless body into one of my old pods. Take me to her. What is it you fleshlings do to calm down? Breathe? Yes. Breathe and tell me what happened. There's no time to explain. Here, I can pay. Now let's sail. Very well. I know precisely where the Cyclops of Kefalonia was taking your young friend. It's a gate. The place should seem familiar to all of you. Oh, thank you. Now we have to go. Home on Kefalonia. How is this possible? Baby! Baby! Been a long time. Heard you and the girl finally came down to join us. Couldn't pass up the opportunity to show you both a warm Kefalonian welcome. If you hurt her, if I will cut out your other fucking eye, and this time it's going up your ass, Cyclops. No one calls me that. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cut out one of your eyes! Come and try. Ha! <laughs> 
No, 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 no. Ella. Ella. Earth. Mother of all. I greet you. Aniazo. Cassandra? You're okay. And you're here. I'll always be with you, Phoebe. Forever. No matter what. Thank you. Can you stand? Oof. What is this place? And where is the Cyclops? Don't worry, the Cyclops is gone. And this? Is a doorway to Elysium. So that's it? Through there? I'll find my real parents. You can do this, Phoebe. Let's go. Seeing this place makes me miss Kefalonia. We had some good days, didn't we? I don't want to go. You have no choice, Phoebe. You belong with your parents. No. I belong with you. Please, don't make me go. Don't be afraid. I'm leaving this place too once I finish what I started. But I will be with you. I, uh found this. Take it with you. To keep me close. What if... my parents don't like me? Of course they're going to like you. They'll do more than like you. They'll love you. But I won't be able to forget you. You're my family too. Can I come back here and find you? No. Once you leave, you can never come back. But one day, a long time from now, I will come to you, and we'll tell each other all about our adventures. You'll always be my family, no matter what. I think I'm ready. Phoebe, the warrior who sailed to the Golden Fields. Phoebe, who plunged into the underworld to save her family. Phoebe, the eagle bearer. You have made me so proud. Walk tall. I told you she wouldn't let the kid lose her memories. Instead, she drew out the child's own strength and inspired her to endure her burden. Remarkable.
better stay hidden. Fabulous. Now let me tell you my plan to catch the monger. Let's hear it. I'm ready. Exceptional. I'll distract the prisoners while you head straight to the monger. We can't let him escape. Once you defeat him, take him to the deepest abyss of Tartaros. You'll have to pass through the entrails of Gaia to get there. Entrails of... Uh, never mind. Let's go. But as I told you, We make a good pair. At first I was worried you wouldn't stick to the plan. You haven't been very trusting of me. Can you really blame me? You and the cult destroyed my life. I understand, but tell me you see that I've changed. That I'm trying to do good in death where I failed in life. I cannot move on without your acceptance. I suppose you have changed. A bit. My dear eagle bearer, 
You have no idea what your forgiveness means to me. Who said anything about forgiveness? I feel as though I can finally move on. Hades! I... we returned the monger to Tartarus for you, just as you asked. I made no such request. But you referred to the monger as a thorn in your side. And you inferred that I wanted him returned. Clearly you still have much to learn, Elpinor. We'll discuss this later at my palace. Still, I'm on my way to eternal peace, thanks to you. I believe you're forgetting something, brother. Why would you help your enemy find peace? I thought you and Elpinor were working together. Elpinor? was merely a means to further along your far more interesting journey. Any chance this means you'll teach me more about the staff now? Patience, Keeper. A few more twists are still to come along your path. I'm looking forward to seeing how it all plays out. You used Elpinor as some sort of trial for me. Close. But the fates wove your path with a defter hand than that. What are you talking about? You'll know soon enough.
It's been a long time since I had a good fight. Heracles, I'm not here to fight you. Heracles, rise up and be a hero for Hades and for all the people in the underworld. They'll be watching for me. I need to be careful. Oh! <gasps> 
This is it. Brasidas' shield being a place for dishonored warriors. He was the most honorable warrior I knew. It doesn't make sense. The door is locked. I need to find a way in. These symbols might be the key to opening the door. Lithi's water here in the underworld to forget. Water, time, the mind. It's another riddle. I should return to the door. Underworld. 
drink the water, it makes you forget. Your time spent living is lost. Clever. I should be careful. High security here. State your business! Good luck! Shields. Which one belongs to Brasidas? I should have known that shield was too clean. Ha! 
Achilles, Hades needs you. Go to the gates and guard them with your life. The knowledge of the gods should be useful in the underworld. Your shield, General. I'll never forget the day this was first handed to me. I was a boy. It was as tall as I was. My commander told me, to hold this is to hold up Sparta. Drop it, and Sparta falls. Tell me what Elysium's like. It isn't what you think. It's... Do you feel cold? Elysium is boring. Not since I showed up. Ah, yes. You do have a knack for livening things up wherever you go. Ah, still dreaming of paradise, I see. Well, no one wants you to get what you deserve more than me. I'm glad you two have found each other. We could all use a little help from time to time. Well, you've got your shield. Are you ready to face your enemy? I am. Don't look, Brasidas. Hades is trying to get to you.
been a long time, Rasinas. Come, face your undoing. I am not afraid of you, Themos. What is this? An even greater enemy defeated you long before Demos ended your life. Themos was blessed by the fury of the gods. And even after he cut you down once, you still didn't learn. It wasn't hubris. I fought for honor. You made Sparta proud that day, Brasidas. You honored your father's oath. Perhaps I didn't. A Spartan should trust the warrior at their side. This time, we fight together. It would be my honor. It was good fighting together again. I guess it's time to say goodbye. The spears were my brother's idea. Poseidon can be cruel sometimes. I did as you asked. You promised me Elysium. Hmm. Not quite. But you said... I said that to walk Elysium in death, a son of Sparta must confront that which defeated him in life. And you have not yet done so. I know, I know. It's all very hard to wrap your little mortal minds around. Which is why I'm going to help you. Why these games? Why not just let him go? Because eternity is long. Letting you go wouldn't be much fun, now would it? Find the forest of Oasis. The dead will point the way. The forest of Oasis. Sounds inviting. It's where I keep the miserable humans who ended their mortal suffering by their own hand. If there's one thing I hate, it's uninvited guests. The dead will point the way to what? I wouldn't want to spoil the surprise. You'll just have to... trust me. Come, Brasidas. The sooner we get this done, the sooner you can be free of this place. Now what? Hades told us the dead would point the way. 
for you. Who are you? I am Lilera, and you are Brasidas. General, conqueror, hero. Hades sent me to find you. So you finally come to reunite me with my love. Charon carried us along the river, but we got separated. Bring my love to me, and I'll tell you all I know. Where must I go? Between the sulfuric pools and the village of the condemned, there is a cave. My love lies within. This task is mine. I will go. I can't imagine spending eternity without those I love. You must be in great pain. I'll tell you all. If Brasidas succeeds... What do you mean, if? The weight of the past can be a much heavier burden to carry than we realize. I should go find him. He might need my help. This must be the place.
you are. What's wrong? What is this place? The cradle of the underworld. Little ones who die too soon are kept here. The dead cannot enter. The dead can't enter, eh? Well, let's see about the living. Don't ask any questions. Best keep out of sight. Oh, no! 
Gods, how I've missed this! You're dead! What did you find? Ashes. 
Her love was her baby. Why would Hades have you return the ashes of a woman's child? I don't know. What did you do to him? The past was too much for him to bear. Brasidas, talk to me. I... can't. Please. I know you've suffered. Still suffer. Tell me what happened and we'll leave you alone. We were quiet before the Spartans came. My husband was no warrior. He looked at the Our land was occupied by Athens. Our men were friends, supplied with armor and weapons in case of invasion. I don't know what happened. War is chaos. If you want to point fingers, point them at Ares. The god of war didn't run his sword through my husband. Didn't throw me and my child to the ground. Rasidas the Butcher did. Come, Brasidas. There is nothing more to be done here. Honor the gods. Honor Sparta. Keep your oaths, and Elysium is yours. I made an oath to protect the innocent, and I broke it. Still feel you deserve to walk the fields of paradise, butcher? Don't call him that. Why not? 
That woman's entire village does. What's left of it, anyways? You Spartans really know how to torch a village. You never answered my question. Say the word, and Elysium is yours. Help me, Cassandra. I, I don't know what to do. Prasidas, you were a friend like no other. You lived and died with honor to the gods and to Sparta. And you kept all your oaths to me. If anyone deserves to walk the fields of Elysium, it's you. I lived by a code of honor. And now in death, I've done what you've asked. I will go to Elysium. Ah, yes. Your father's code. What was it? Honor the gods. Honor Sparta. Blah, blah, blah. I did everything in my power to prove you failed to live up to that code, but I suppose someone helped to convince you otherwise. Your decision's been made. The fields of Elysium are yours. But know this. I never make a mistake. You'll be the only one in Elysium who doesn't belong there. The moment these ashes leave your hands is the moment you'll find yourself in Tartarus forever. Now say goodbye. I suppose not all Spartans are as predictable as you thought. Goodbye, Presidas. <laughs>